Last time I made a video, I was about to hit 100 subscribers, and that was huge! That's a big milestone for me! And now, thanks to Mr. William Haynes, I'm about to hit 200! Thank you so much to all of you if you subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it, and I, I'm not even sure how to handle it right now. So, here's an unflattering picture of William Haynes as thank you. Yeah, I hope you're enjoying that. I'm planning a special video for 200 subscribers. That should be done soon. Hint, it's a wrap. I'm gonna wrap for you guys, for real this time. But today, for, I guess, it's my really late... It's not even late, though, because it's only been like a couple days. It just landslide. Thank you so much for 100 subscribers. I feel insane and awesome. And... Uh, guest star time. My sister just got home from work. And she told me she had some crazy stories. So I figured the best way to go about this would be to turn on the camera and have her tell them for you. So here we go. Hi guys. So first, there's this grandpa and his little kid. Uh -huh. And this is funny because of how often people think that you're a guy. Uh -huh. And he's like, give the tickets to the nice man. And then she's like, it's a girl. <laughs> Yeah, I just thought it was funny because you always complain about how often people call you a guy. <laughs> okay, so the next thing that happened was this car pulls up, the lady like gets out of her car, like drop off to go get yeah. tickets or something. Honestly, at first, I thought she was carrying snakes in her hands. <laughs> and I was like, what? Oh, but they're not moving. It can't be snakes. And so then I, I thought it was rope, that she was just like carrying wads of rope uh -huh. in her hands. And so I was like, okay, that was weird. And she came in with this other lady who gave me the tickets, so I didn't even really pay attention to it. Yeah. Later on, I'm on my break, sitting up in the employee room. Projectionist John, he comes in, and he's like, did you see that lady with the nails? And I was like, what are you talking about? And he's like, she had nails, and they were like <laughs> this long. <laughs> That's what that was? I thought she was carrying rope or something. It was her fingernails, and they're like like a quarter round, oh, and they're like and they God. curl at the end. It was disgusting, and they were they was like longer than a foot. Did she buy popcorn? I don't know. I th How would you oh. eat popcorn? And she's like, uh. <laughs> I would, or maybe her friend would feed her the popcorn <laughs> with her knuckles. Like, yeah, it was weird. Last thing that happened that was just crazy. It's getting kind of busy. People are coming in and there's like this little girl. She's like three, yeah. maybe a little younger. And she like comes and stands by the door. And so I'm like, okay, well your mom must be near, right? Just like right over there or something. Mm -hmm. And the girl just like starts running into the theater, right? And I'm like, what? what? <laughs> Who does this child belong to? And the mom, and then, so I was like, okay, maybe it's this lady's. And she comes in and she like yells for the girl and then goes and gets her, right? And takes her outside. Yeah. And then the girl, she comes over back by the door and I was like, okay, if she's gonna move, I'm gonna say something. <laughs> and so she starts like running towards concession. Like the rope is up and I'm like, oh my gosh, where she goes out of there. So I was like, sweetie, don't you think you should wait for your mom? And then uh, she just like keeps running <laughs> and the mom comes back inside and like picks her up and then the girl is just like giggling like it's a game now right and then this guy he 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 bought a ticket so he didn't sneak in or anything he comes up to me and he gives me the ticket and i'm like there's something weird about this guy like he's not acting right uh -huh. and i started thinking maybe he's drunk because he's kind of acting like it yeah and so he goes in and he just kind of like like really confused about what he's doing and so he asked Justin I'm looking for this movie right and he's like oh it's right over there and then he went over and told Kayla and they were like what is up with this guy and then he ran into that little girl and like knocked her over oh no John was like did you see what just happened like we have to make this guy leave he's obviously totally drunk yeah and so they go over and Kayla what time and was Alyssa, this it was like Three, almost four. So that's that's way too early to be drunk. To be drunk. So they get him to like start leaving, right? They tell him that he has to leave, and he's just like acting all weird, you know. And he can't even walk straight. His words are slurring. It's more like he was doing drugs oh than drinking. And when he walked past me, it smelled kind of like vodka. But I don't know what drugs smell like, so I don't <laughs> know if it was that or not. He comes back and like walks in, and Alyssa like books it over there and she's like sir can I help you with something and then he's like oh, yeah, I bought something and left it and then she's like do you have a receipt of the purchase because he didn't buy anything yeah he, he couldn't even have found the concession stand <laughs> so she's like 
you have to leave. And so he leaves, and then John Mariani goes out there, and he's like, stands and watches and like, makes sure he leaves. And then he comes back in, and I was like, Johnny's not coming back, right? And he's like, no. And I was like, good, because I don't want to deal with that. So it was a good day. Yeah. Christy's favorite movie is Kung Fu Panda. Not really. But not really. It's How to Train Your Dragon, but it wouldn't fit. <laughs> Next best thing. Depression. This setup just reminds me of like if we're in a like either like a bad boy band from the 90s or we could be like a rap group, you know? I just feel like we're just on like a bad album cover right now. Oh yeah, Ponder Collar, of course. And I got my big t-shirt on, so.